We just got a late update on those workers' conditions. First, take a look behind me at this building. It's a very familiar building, especially if you can commute up the expressway. You see this every day. Federal safety investigators tell me tonight that they will be looking into what happened here today. For more than two hours, steam poured out of the upper floors of this nine-story building near South Station. Now, this is a boiler facility. It provides steam for buildings all around downtown Boston. Boston firefighters say a pipe burst in the basement here, trapping two workers down there. Now, they were ready rescued and taken to the hospital with what were described as non-life-threatening injuries. With steam, there are steam burns, and while you, you'll, you can see burns externally easily enough, steam always brings with it the concern of inhalation injury, so it will have to be evaluated for inhalation injury as well. This plant is 90 years old. It's owned by a company called Vicinity Energy, and the company recently told the Boston Globe it would like to tear down this steam plant and redevelop this parcel and surrounding areas into a mixed use project. Now, late today, a spokesperson for Vicinity Energy told me that one of the injured workers has been released from Mass General Hospital and that the other is being treated for burns on his arm. Live in downtown Boston, David Beating, WCVB News.